Hey everyone, welcome back where we are testing every single mask on Amazon and today we are testing all of the American made masks. But this one is a question mark. A company called Medtex that we found, got a big American flag on it, says made in the USA, but we're not really sure that it is. So let's get this thing testing and then we will jump in. Got to clamp it. I'm a clamp, I'm a clamp, I'm a clamp, I'm a clamp. I'm a clamp. All right. This is a PFE, particulate filtration efficiency machine. It's the reason you showed up today is this big, beautiful bad boy. More on that at that link. All right, so why don't we think this is made in the USA? Well, when we look at the listing, um, we look at all the boxes here for all their other products don't say made in the USA. But for some reason, this one with the American flag on it says made in the USA. So we kind of dug a little bit deeper and went on their website and a lot of weird stuff's going on here. Like for example, they say that they have an N95 mask, right, N95. But when we look at the actual mask up close, it's not an N95 because it has to say N95 and have a TC number on it. And it says made in the Philippines. When we looked up on their website for all of their FDA registered facilities, none of them are in the United States. When we go on their LinkedIn page, none of their employees are in the United States. They don't have an F, they don't have a NIOSH listing. They are listed, this is the weirdest part, on the FDA's EAU page, but when I look up the company on the FDA's page, it doesn't show up. A lot of question marks here. A lot of question marks. All right, let's look at the box. Um, they are claiming ASTM level two, so we will be testing that today. Um, that means it needs to hit 98% or better. This is their brand called Cover You. Let's see, this is a white mask. There's, it's not sealed, so I don't like that. We know this is the MedTax mask because they've got that embroidered twice on there, embroidered <laughs> twice on there. So, two times. This is a really well put together product and they have a very unique way of folding their material. I've never seen a <laughs> never seen a mask like that. Ear loops, not ideal. This is a medical uh, technology company. It looks like they've been doing this for a long time in Taiwan. Um, I think these guys know what they're doing, but the ear loops leave something to be desired. I'm giving it a good pull here, but it, I, I'm going to give them five out of ten on the ear loops because like, I don't think it's gonna break when you put it on your face, but it's less than ideal. Okay, okay, I'm getting a, a smell here. Um, I'm gonna call this one a uh, Costco box of utensils. It's kind of got a plastic plus a cardboard smell, probably because it's sitting uh, inside the, the cardboard there. Uh, all right, but does any of that matter if it doesn't protect you? So again, they're making claims that they're ASTM level two. All right, 98% or better. What does the machine say? That machine is meant to specifically test this. Okay, close, 97.481, 97.481. Again, when you're doing an ASTM test, you gotta do 20 or 30 of these and you average them. It's very, very possible that they could be hitting above that 98. They're not quite there, but I'm not gonna, outright call it fraud. Made in the USA though? That's a question mark for me. I, I don't know that these are made in the USA. Haven't heard of these guys. Um, and everything else is, is made in, I mean, it, even on their website, I'll just do one more time here. Like they have, you know, half their websites in Chinese. I, it's just, it, it's weird. A lot of question marks on that one. So, all right. Well, uh, if you enjoyed this, I really appreciate it. Appreciate you being here. If you, if you can help me unravel this mystery a little bit more, like put, put some stuff in the comments. I'd love to know if you have any insight. If, if you are from MedTech and you do have a facility here and you're just not listing on your website, let me know and I will, I will put a correction in. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you on the next test.